Hello everybody and thanks for coming back to Spectacular Vernacular. We have not decided on a title for this particular series, but it is basically following up on the videos we've made where we're going to get into the technical details. I'm here with Mike Volkowski, Director of Security Solutions. Director, what's your title? Advanced Technologies. Advanced Technologies? Okay, let's check this thing out. Okay, there we go. Skyrim, what's going on? Working from home. Okay, so let's pause there for a second. We did this video just as the whole coronavirus business was starting and um, people were working home and freaking out, trying to figure out what are they going to do about this work from home situation. We wanted to make sure that we also talked about security uh, opportunities and challenges that go along with this, and we'll get into that here in a second. Uh, the TPS report cover sheet. We have this come up on screen right now. TPS report work cover sheet, obviously a call out to... Office space. Office space, absolutely. Yeah. Look at that, four to client VPN. We just paused there for one second. So let's talk about VPNs. What's it stand for? Sure, uh, virtual private network. You're taking a normal network, mm -hmm. um, you know, and you're overlaying a, a private network. VPNs at their, at their core are, you know, basically creating tunnels. So you reach over a ransomware file, ransomware file. So what is that indicating? So let's talk about the intention of, you know, this particular ransomware or ransomware in general. <laughs> <laughs> So they're really targeting um, more central central assets, and you know you mentioned SMB. So th these types of file servers, which are you know centralized and holding more valuable data mm -hmm. to the organization. Um, so with with scripting and with you know simple code, um, you can check the operating system. You can check what what type of services are running on the on the machine. That's right. And there are also uh, errors that can be done. For example, if you have self-encrypting drives, that's amazing because if somebody gets a hold of the drive out of your self-encrypted drive laptop or something, there's no way they can get in. However, there are attacks wherein if those drives have been initialized improperly, that can become an instantaneous encryption. Very nice yoga pose there. Is that... Um, is that down dog? Or what uh, you... It's my attempt at a down dog. Attempt at a down dog. Yeah. Okay, great. <laughs> Uh, for Vector USA, I'm Scott Bly, Customer Solutions Architect. We're here to help you with anything you need. Uh, be sure to check out Vector USA. We'll have links in the video below. Thanks for sticking around. Namaste.